Andrea Sansone, and tonight on First Look, we're satisfying our sweet tooth with sugar and spice and everything nice. All I eat is chocolate, folks. All I eat is chocolate. It's the best in dessert, and these treats will make you say, mm. Better than sex. What? <laughs> now that's a comment for you. So go ahead, have your cake and pie, and eat it too. Do a sugar high. Cheers. 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 It's all tonight on First Look. place in New York City, you don't have to go too far to find something out of the ordinary. But when it comes to unique desserts, there's only one spot you need to know. Mm. It's delicious. It's interesting. It doesn't taste like anything I've ever had before. Spot dessert bars in East Village Gym, where the first thing that hits you is the intoxicating smell. Everything is made in-house and baked fresh daily. And the second thing you notice it's that this crowd is really, really digging these desserts. It's pretty rad. <laughs> a bakery that incorporates Asian influence with Western desserts and brings fresh and exotic delights to life that are entirely one of a kind. Chef Ian Kalaram Kitty Chai is famed as Thailand's first celebrity chef whose cooking has been tasted worldwide in hotels, restaurants, gastropubs, and dessert bars. As I'm traveling everywhere around the world, so I pick a few different things, the culture and also different ingredients, spice, herbs, and then I try to combine it with the American dessert. With a chef this good, I've got to hear what people are ordering. You guys did a good job today. We did a very good job. <laughs> what did you have? The chocolate lava cake. I've had lava cakes before, but never with flavors that explode like this. I got the high key creme brulee. The bacon and date cupcake. The yuzu Eskimo cake. It's really good. Mm. Even when it's savory, it's spot on. And Chef Ian's gonna show me how it's done. Today we're gonna do the uh, Thai tea creme brulee. Mm. I'm gonna make it so easy and simple for you. Easy and simple for me? Yeah, because of what you said, it's gonna be like really difficult for you to do the baking and stuff. Don't tell everyone. <laughs> now that Chef Ian has outed me as having two left feet in the kitchen, we set out to make the enticing Thai tea creme brulee. First, we fuse the Thai tea with the milk. Next. I would like you to help me to uh, getting the yolk into the bowl and then pour the sugar in. Sugar. Sugar. No dessert is complete without sugar. And then the Thai tea mixture is added to the eggs and the tea leaves get strained from the creme brulee mixture. I have never done anything no. like this for a dessert. I mean, it, I do like Rice Krispie treats and chocolate chip cookies and that's about it. And even those are sometimes a disaster. <laughs> Thai tea, ta-da! After cooling and a little more sugar, this kitchen is only just heating up. Oh, fire! Awesome! Is fine? Yeah. I can't believe you're letting me do this. That is the most fun I've ever had making a dessert. Our creme brulee is then plated with sides of Thai tea, evaporated milk, and simple syrup. I can't wait to taste this masterpiece. Besides the Thai tea creme brulee, Chef Ian also whipped up his smoked coconut cheesecake and 12-layer crepe cake. Here we go, we have two wow. more plates. Almost looks too good to eat. Yeah. Almost. <laughs> that is not like any creme brulee I've ever had. It's smoother, it's velvety, it's silky, it's really good. I also like the presentation. No it's very nice, well put together. From plate to palate, these flavors and textures are totally different and unexpected. Look at the layers. This stuff is too pretty. That was not what I expected. There's really like melt in your mouth, right? It's like tangy and yeah. it almost reminds me of a key lime. Mm -hmm. I think once our customers get accustomed to our unusual, unique flavors, I think that's what brings them back to Spot Dessert Bar. You just don't find desserts like this everywhere. I would say I've never had anything like this in my life. Chef, your dessert bar definitely hit my sweet spot. And now you're getting some sugar oh. from me. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs>